Chuck Fresh with Computer Care, and we're talking about today Windows 7. I've seen a lot of computers in with Windows 7, and they're just painfully slow. High CPU usage, high memory usage, and no one seems to f figure out why. So we did a little digging, we checked in uh, Task Manager, and we're seeing the service host at a higher CPU than usual, and a bunch of memory, and this thing just keeps adding up. So it's one of two things. It's either malware, which is unlikely at this point because they've cleaned up most of the things that affected that, or it is a Windows 7 update going haywire. And you can right-click on that service on the, uh, on the process, and you can see exactly what's going on. The WUAU serve is part of Windows Update, and that's part of that service host thing. So, um, I don't know what Microsoft's doing. I don't know if they're back Windows 7 updates for now because of Windows 8 and Windows 10. But it's, apparently people are having a hard time downloading and getting these updates installed in Windows 7. Now they're going to issue updates for Windows 7 through 2020, so that's a good thing. So you can continue to use your Windows 7 computer through 2020, even later. And uh, But the updates seem to be a, a problem. So what you either have to do is just work your way through it, deal with the slowness, or you can use an update utility that will update your computer automatically and you can bypass downloading these things from Windows servers and then uh, hopefully get your computer up and running a little faster again. So what you can do in the meantime is find that service host process and then click on it in your task manager and end process and that'll give you a little bit of headway but then it's going to start up all over again automatically and you're going to end up in the same boat. So what you really need to do is use a utility. Now we found one called Windows Update, I don't actually know what it's called, WSUS. And what it is, is an update installer. What it does is manually downloads all the Windows updates and throws them all on a flash drive or a CD or something or on your computer. It's WSUS Offline Update, which you can uh, find online. And uh, download all that stuff and uh, it will automatically install all those updates and once that's done it does take a while it can take several hours but once that is done it will uh, you'll avoid the uh, delay on your computer and it'll pick right up and it'll be much faster we've done this a bunch of times and it seems to be the hang up the Windows updates in Windows 7 Windows 8 and Windows 10 seem to be fine on their updates but Windows 7 has got this weird delay going on so try that WSUS update if you've got a very slow Windows 7 computer and hopefully that will solve all your problems Chuck Fresh from Computer Care Clinic with your tip of the day